You know what annoys me so much? I don't understand how this looks so well drawn, yet so ugly. Like, look at this. The eyes aren't even aligned. We're gonna fix this meme, okay? A lot of people are gonna hate me for this. To them, it's like fixing the Mona Lisa, but that's okay. I'm doing God's work. It had to be done. Okay, we're finished. Smegzy. Art things I hate. When the art has no background. Hear me out. This whole piece looks so weird. Why is she forming an L? Is it because this is an L post? You know what I've realized with these drawings there's so much negative space it looks weird there's so much unnecessary white in the background there's no context she's just floating over here i mean look at this white background but she looks okay and this also looks okay i think so why does this look weird in comparison well compare this bro is floating in space like what is bro doing are you levitating or why are you slightly tilted like the leaning tower of pisa we're gonna compare this to this yes okay white background again but this time he's not levitating or not slightly tilted it looks like there's actual space he's occupying you want to know why because there's a shadow and also his pose obviously keep that in mind you should always add context around your art so you stop doing those random white backgrounds all right muscle mommy again she is levitating but at least there's a background nine out of ten Speaking of backgrounds, crappy background. Wait, crappy background? That kind of sounds like capybara. Like, what is that? Like, is he sitting on a banana filled with worms or what? Do it jiggle? Like, I appreciate the effort in putting a background, but this looks like the chill lo-fi wallpapers that you can find on Google, the royalty-free ones. Okay, now the background is moving. Ooh! Optical illusion. Juicy. Another one. I feel like you guys don't know the difference between Gaussian blur and motion blur. Please educate yourselves. You know what, guys? I don't hate that you're slapping on random Google images for your background. You don't even know if that's copyright free. I don't hate you guys at all for copy pasting. You do what you do. You work smart, not hard. But it's just that y'all are not even trying. You're not trying to blend it with your drawing. Ooh. Ooh. Very nice rendering. W what the? What is that goofy looking bike? What is that? The Mike Wazowski bike or something? Okay, after crappy backgrounds, we got crappy lighting. Bruh, what happened to his jaw? Okay, wait, let's try to paint over. I'm not experienced with lighting, but this is what I would do. First, I would airbrush that whole jaw out. Just face tune that baby. And now it looks flat, like your chest. Boohoo. Okay, now this is what we're gonna do. See those juicy highlights on the forehead and the cheek? We're gonna put those juicy highlights back. There we go. And then we're just going to blend that baby out. The blending on the chin is also confusing. What the hell is that, dude? So we're gonna fix that. So let's create a stronger contrast around the eyes. Basically, blend like so. Oh yeah, and the hair too. Lastly, I'm gonna add the hearts because I want to. Right, so this is the result. So just a few improvements can go a long way from malnourished man to yassified facetuned handsome squidward weird anatomy is his neck okay this is kind of like that wolf meme the problem is that the hair is kind of weird, bro. You don't even know where this horn is coming out of. It's coming out of his hair. Bro, what the heck are those transparent boxes, dude? Pov, fake transparent background images on Google. Look, I can understand the weird tail coming out of her booty hole. Furries are weird like that. However, does she even have a knee, bro? Look, I've opened it up on Sai. Look at this. Bro, this is supposed to be where the knee is at, alright? What the hell happened, dude? Does she got two knees or something? Does she got- what? Okay, this is your fault, furry. Okay, I can't tell if this is avatar fan art or a horse. Oh, you got that vibe, Jimin. Bruh, that ain't Jimin. That's Jim out. Just kidding. That's oily London right there. Oh, uh, you want me to fix that for you? done juicy i tried my best i tried my best more like i tried my breast <clears throat> side eye the eyes are one eye apart bro one two bro you can fit three eyes in there bro is she undergoing mitosis or something oh interesting huh why is that empty what did i teach you guys after all these years 
Don't be a coward. Reposting this just so I can get roasted by the goddess herself. Mmm. Interesting. She needs facial reconstruction, bro. I hate drawing clothing. Bro, why are her boobas melting? Bro made them humongous. Posting for the sake of posting. Guys, I know that the algorithm sucks, that you need to post regularly, but there is absolutely no need to show us whatever this is. It's horrifying. Listen guys, the reality of posting your work in progress is that your art already has to be good. Exhibit A, what I'm about to show you is from art Leah, look at the caption over here. Burr, a work in progress. Emphasis on work in progress. Does that look like a work in progress to you? With all them beautiful eyebrows? Bro, he looks like he has a million eyelashes. And you can see how dry his lips are. That's okay though, it's still kissable. See, this guy is not playing, okay? If you want to post your whips, you gotta pretend that it's not finished yet. Even though it's 99% finished. So you get likes. I'm not saying that this is already finished though. It's probably just a floating head. Oh, I drew it fast, lol. Oh, we can tell. This is what I mean when I say that you're posting for the sake of posting. What does this even mean? Why is he looking up? Is that a raccoon? <gasps> Among Us Ball? What the? Bro, you completely messed up her eyes. Let me fix it real quick. Done. Crappy effects. I can't stand these random as hell effects over here. Like, what is that? The Naruto logo? It's like you're just experimenting with brushes over here. Wow, amazing. Graphic design is my passion. Look at those random water emojis. It represents maximum drip. Like, what the heck are these effects, bro? Is she getting an x-ray or something? Why the random inverted color, dude? The thing about these effects is that they're so random, huh? OCs, Demangle and Orthodox. Uh, those are the edgiest names I've ever heard. They are sisters, by the way. Bro, I don't even want to know what this is about. And now there's different shadows of himself. They're all very blurry. I don't understand the purpose of this. Daddy? Oh, Smegzy. 999 out of 10. She looks very disgusted. 11 out of 10. This is my face when I see all of your art. Juicy lips. Ew. Furry. Negative 100 out of 10. You know what guys, the best part about this whole roast challenge is that I get to see drama unfold. Exhibit A. Someone posted their art. Okay. But then we look at the comments over here. Fairizu says, pretty. Jewel Rabe says, I'm pretty sure this would get in Colleen's roast me video. What is that supposed to mean? Lamel. I can't tell if that's a good thing or not. But I hope I am though. Bro, if I was them, I would probably be offended. But yes, Jewel Rabe was indeed correct. It did get into the video because the lips are ugly as hell. So if y'all want to get roasted by me, just submit through the hashtag on Instagram. Hashtag Cooleen Roast Me. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you in the next video. Stay cool.